Yes, uh, we're working on um, releasing some new singles. Uh, the next one's going to be called Wild Orchids. And um, be released digitally. And um, so, yes, we're, I'm always writing, I'm always uh, working really hard, you know. Uh, we're going to be performing some here at the concert. <clears throat> um, three new songs from the next album. Uh, and there's no title yet. But we have it commissioned with, um, with uh, K Records in the States. Um, I mean, sorry, it'll be on K Records on the, in the States. And... There's no title yet. I think uh, my references are from every time. You know, I, I listen to uh, such a wide scope of music. Um, and I appreciate every genre. Um, a lot of the new album coming out is um, sounds really modern because we're using uh, just the way we're recording it and also uh, the sounds are really exciting. So uh, I would say the newer album sounds less uh, I mean, sorry, the newer album sounds really modern. A lot of the artists from, uh, like, uh, Early Sonic Youth, um, early Sepado, um, early T Rex, and uh, a lot of Susie and the Benches. Oh, um, I've been listening to a lot of like Delta Blues. Um, and I, I really appreciate music that can be done just with a guitar and singing, you know, but done really well, like Delta Blues, proper, uh, also like a lot of Chicago blues when they started adding more instruments, but before that, I really liked the Delta Blues. Um, I think that uh, it's okay. You know, I really like Ariel Pink. Um, we come from the same city. Um, I think his music's good. No, I'm not. I'm not uh, envious of media coverage. But it's always good, you know. The more, yeah, the more people on your side, the better. <laughs> you know. Hey, records, they don't. There's no publicity. There's no. Um, I, I think it's a, a record label meant for people who want to discover something. And the way that Calvin Johnson says it is that he says it's you know, have, like having a library card to a library, you know. It's, the library doesn't 
advertise in the media what books they have, you know. So I think it's just meant as a label where you can go and maybe discover something you like. I think that that's their approach, maybe. Which is good in some ways. Um, I really like uh, Bradford uh, Cox from Deer Hunter. He's a really nice guy. Actually, we were talking the other day when we played um, Primavera. Uh, Bradford and I hung out and talked for a while. He's a really cool guy, really genuine. We took the only way out. Yeah. Uh, oh, wow. Um, I really like the band. Uh, <coughs> Uh, that are on 4AD, most of them. Um, I like uh, a lot of the bands coming out on um, Captured Tracks, and um, I like a lot of the bands coming out on uh, Fat Possum, and uh, there's a label out of LA called 100% Silk, which is making these 12-inch disco records, kind of, like new disco. Um, I like a lot of that stuff. Um, there's also another label called um, Art Fag out of San Diego that's putting out a lot of good bands. Um, I actually just went and bought a uh, bleached 7-inch single um, at their show in London. Good band. Do you know this band Bleach? Really good. They're, they're, they're a couple of girls from um, LA. Really good band. Really raw. And just, you know, really good. <laughs> yeah. I'm working on several other projects. I have a band, a new band I'm working on where I'm just playing synthesizers and um, doing the drum machine. And it's a new band called Eclipse that I'm working on with it, um, actually my girlfriend who's singing. And um, I'm also working on another band called Shades where um, I do the singing, but it's more synthesizer based. And um, also on my solo record. Um, so I'm really busy in the studio recording and mixing. I actually, we actually just finished mixing two albums uh, two days ago. So we, all this year, that's what I've been working on since January. Um, so we'll see what happens with that and uh, hopefully book a tour in uh, October and uh, hopefully try to play as many countries in Europe as possible and, ho and hopefully go to, uh, uh, to the States and Canada and Mexico City. Uh, we really like playing in Mexico City, so we want to try to go out there again. Yeah, it's Jeremy J. Yeah. And uh, it'll be in promotion of uh, the new singles coming up. 